This was the most intriguing thing to me. The most anticipated album of the year. Is it really the most anticipated album of the year? You know what I'm saying? I gotta say, he put this motherfucker together very quickly. And it make me wonder about this. You know how he was releasing so much music? It's all these songs, the Fresh Bastard songs that he did while he was out. Or with some already saved. And he went and, you know... Put some work to it, you know, live vocals, maybe switched up to production a little bit. It just makes me wonder, though, you know what I mean? But Happy Songs is already out, Back on Road, Way Back, uh, what else? Gucci's Home, First Day Out the Feds, All My Children. So we heard half the album even before, you know, it, it was released. So let's get into it. I'm not feeling the album cover art, though, to keep it 100. But I mean... It's Gucci, so I heard some good things about it. People were like, yo, you gotta check it out. It's shit hard, it's fire. And put this in mind. Is it better than um Rap the State versus Ragic Davis? Cause to me that's a fucking classic. It will always be a classic. Come on now. Boom. Yeah, I'm not really feeling the um color scheme he used. Oh, he's still with Atlantic. That's what's up. Goo Wop Entertainment. Damn, so what happened to IC Records 1017 Brit Squad? Now it's Goo Wop Entertainment, I guess. See him right there, diamond up. So now can people let that shit go? Well, it's a fake Gucci. No, it's him sober. You know what I'm saying? Motherfuckers been on lean and pills and weed their whole fucking life and go to jail for, say, five years and come out. And it's, you know, just talk regular with proper English. Niggas think you a fucking clone. That shit is crazy. Now that's different. I wonder if that's made out of real ice, which it probably ain't. But then again, knowing him, it could be. He very, he does eccentric things at times. Nice diamonds, though. I'll tell you that. It's not bad. And he's confined to, you know, house arrest. So that's why you see a lot of interviews and a lot of videos um, at his crib. But he was, like, doing, like, a little tour. Not a tour, but, you know, parties and shit like that. So I guess that's cool. You know, it is what it is. I fuck with First, first Day Out the Feds. I really don't like the Back on Road joint. You know, I don't really fuck with that. The Kanye record I heard, All My Children, that shit was crazy. No, I'm surprised nobody jumped out the window saying anything about that because you know who he's referring to. But that's a that's a record where I want to know who do y'all think he's talking about in that um that song All My Children, like all the artists from Atlanta that seemed to pop off uh, after he went in. You know what I mean? You gotta separate the Dick Riders' paws from the actual day ones of Gucci. But that's the album, man. The opening and everything. Once I hear it, I'll definitely uh, check it out. But I don't think this shit is going to be doper than The State versus Roderick Davis. You know, it probably has some bangers on here. But at the end of the day, I mean, it's Gucci. What can you expect? You know what I mean? Either you like him or you don't. But I can say that he's came, he's come a long way, you know, since his earlier works and everything like that. But yeah, man, if y'all picked it up, let me know if you picked it up. And if you didn't, you got some singles. What singles did you get? All right, one.